Hello and thank you for watching another installation of uh, tutorials on how to optimize market uh, your Joomla website. Okay, so today what we're going to do, we're talking about how to optimize your Joomla installation so that it loads faster. Because a lot of owners, what happens is that they start to realize that as you start to install components and modules and extensions, plugins, uh, into your Joomla installation, you start to find that it starts to slow down. So what we recommend is that uh, there's a few things that you can do in order to optimize it. One is to uh, optimize your PHP INI file, okay, in your backend control panel. And this is recommended for people who have a Linux server with a cPanel configuration setting, okay. So what we're going to do is that you log into your cPanel settings in the backend. You're going to go to your PHP INI file because that's where it is for here. For other settings, uh, for other uh, servers, such as Windows, just Google where your PHP INI settings, uh, location of your PHP INI in your server. And then you'll get uh, pretty much uh, a lot of documentation on how to find your PHP INI file so that you can modify them. This PHP INI file has already been modified. Okay, so I'm gonna show you quickly the settings that I recommend using. Okay, so it's the ASP tags are off, register globals are off, safe mode off, upload maximum file size 64 megabytes, post maximum file 64 megabytes, output buffering 1024 bytes, my magic magic file, etc, etc, etc. Okay, and also here are the recommended components that I recommend in order to test out to further optimize your website such as JCH Optimize and Jot Cache. And just go ahead and Google both of these with the extension WordPress or, or Joomla and you will be able to uh, find these very quickly. Okay, and if you want to uh, download these, just visit InZinc.com and go to our blog and you'll be able to get download these uh, these uh, settings. This, you, you'll be able to find these uh, these settings so that you can copy them for yourself, okay? So SourceForge is the place where you're going to uh, download JCH Optimize. And this is jotcomponents.net is where you're going to go to download jotnet cache, uh, jot cache, okay? And you can find all the, uh, the frequently asked questions and as well as documentations. And I always recommend that you go ahead and read the documentations because you have a lot of tips and uh, tricks on how to use these things, okay? And also, they tell you right ahead uh, like some of the most common problems that people face when using their components. So rather than finding out yourself and then trying to troubleshoot something for a couple of days, just go visit uh, their, uh, their frequently asked questions and forums first to see some of the most pertinent problems with these components. But not all of them have problems, I'm just saying as a rule of thumb, okay? And so remember, you're going to want to go to, if you ever want to log into your cPanel, easiest way to find it is just, for example, put in your domain name, <coughs> colon, and then the number 2082, okay? And this is where you're going to go to your, start logging into your control panel. Once again, thank you for watching, and I hope this was helpful for you.